When yeah. you guys went out, when you guys went out, was it just that was it overnight, or was it a slow transition into homelessness, or was it just boom? I had a bed yesterday, and now I'm on the sidewalk. It's gradual, then sudden. You understand what I mean? It's gradual, and, and then with, sudden. And with that, this like, is mustard. Does that make sense? Way. Well, no. It's explain, please. Uh, you, well, 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 let's start from the beginning, mustard. Okay, what's your, I, okay what's your, as he was saying. What's your I story? used to be a normal person. I like starting the story this way. I used to be a normal person. I had a beautiful wife. I had a groovy home in a really nice part of town. I had a really expensive dog. $2,000 that fucking dog cost us. Weren't you in a Metallica video, too? I was, indeed, until it sleeps. <laughs> is, I've been on a lot of TV. This is East Side Dave from the future. Yeah. <laughs> like, my, my, what do you mean, what do you, mean you were in a lot of TV? What else? Um, that we I grew would up know? in Hollywood. I grew up in Hollywood, California. I'm working in the industry since... I'm working in the... Bless you. I'm working Thank in the since I was a little kid. My first job, my first, my first booking gig, my first <laughs> working gig was uh, uh, print work for a Broadway uh, catalog. Um, but some of the stuff we would know you from, obviously a Metallica uh, Wonder video. Wonder Years, there's a TV show called The Wonder Years. You're what? There was an episode of that. I can't remember. It was called Soccer. Yeah. They play soccer. They play soccer, <laughs> and you're you're. I'm on the soccer, soccer team. Uh, Fred, uh, Fred, uh, Savage. Savage. Uh, he joins the soccer team, and I'm one of the goobers on the soccer team. Um, uh, I've done a few music videos. Is he looking up the Intel Sleep videos? Is that what he's doing? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <He's> got... <laughs> and I got no beard. I got long hair. I got hair down to my ass and no beard. Well, what really? part um, did you play yeah. in Until It Sleeps? It's, uh, there's, a, there's, a, there's, a, there's a sequence. Well, the whole thing is based on Salvador Dali. Yep. His interpretation of hell. And um, there's a shot where it's Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ is being held up by the three wise men while a group of people pelt tomatoes at him. And I'm one of the three wise men. Oh, okay. It's well, me and Jesus guys. Christ. So when uh, until it sleeps, this song's what ten years old? Yeah, about about. Like so you, you were still riding high about ten years ago. Yeah, you were doing all right. I was doing all right. So, doing all right. All right, continue. And, yeah. Um. Then a bunch of people died on me. Really? Well, that happens to all of us. Yeah, I know. And that's but that's what it's the snap. But that's what. But that's the you, what somebody said. The straw that broke the camel's back. Yeah, right. Yeah. That was you know, your. Was that was your fine. catalyst. You know, I had some. You know, there's some other shit I could tell you about my childhood. You want to go through that yeah, abuse and the the sexual and like, physical abuse and <laughs> yeah, yeah. abuse oh, really? and all that. We can go through that if you want. But you whatever. So the straw that broke the camel's back was a bunch of people died on me. Um, all right, very suddenly, all right in a row. Mm -hmm. Wow. And I got really depressed. It depressed me. It depressed the hell out of me. Um. And uh, I just kind of, everything just kind of fell away. Everything just kind of fell away. Really? I lost the job. I lost the nice cushy job that I had where I was making way more money than I should have been doing. What was the job? Making. I was selling vitamins over the phone. <laughs> Wholesale. All right. Wait, and that was him. The point is I'm just sitting there doing nothing. Right. Making right way more money than, okay. I, than I deserve hold, to be hold making. Hold on. Yeah, you're right there. On the left. There I am. All the way to the left. All the way on the left. the red right? Yeah, that's me. And the big fucking Pope hat. Yeah, the big Pope hat, yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Yeah. You're, a young, you're a young guy. Right? Yeah, I'm 33 years old. Everybody thinks I'm 50. Oh, yeah. Four, I'll be 48 Sunday. You look Almost good for 48, Joe. Old. 47. Yeah. Black yeah. don't crack. Black don't crack. Yeah, right. That's what they say. That's what they say. So, God damn. So you were selling guy. vitamins over the phone, making a lot of money. Yeah. You had the wife. And you I had was the working nice dog. periodically in, in TV and movies. I've worked both behind and in front of the camera. Sure. I've even done craft services. You know, I've done all sorts of things. So um, you got a hospital the cops, band on too, though. Oh like, yes, I'm a fall risk. I think I'm going to call my band Fall Risk. I've decided. What is that? Oh, <laughs> it fall means because, risk. Fall risk. Uh, because one one of, one of the, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a chronic alcoholic. Uh -huh. In fact, I have some alcohol on me right now. Oh no, no, you know. <laughs> oh yeah, don't tell anybody. <laughs> don't 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 tell Keith the cop that. Um, and uh, um, sometimes <laughs> I black out and I fall. Oh, you'll just black out and fall down? Yeah. Shit. Um, and it's funny, because when I lost everything, I was sober. You know, it wasn't until I came out in the streets I started drinking this way. I went to Washington Square Park one day, and a man named Luders Massillian, an old man from Trinidad, who grew up actually in uh, Montauk, Long Island, he hands me a Poland spring bottle and says, here, vodka. Uh -huh. And it's kind of been really downhill ever since then. <laughs> wow, you're, you're kind of digging the vodka and... Uh... <laughs> Damn. It's a, it's an addiction, you know. As wow. my friend Donnie would say, God, alcohol is a hell of a drug, man. I see, it's a hell of a drug. I see you're not doing well, man. <laughs> hey, white boy. I know you call him a white boy, too. Hey, white boy. Hey, try this. Yeah. <laughs> this will make you feel better. That man drinks a gallon a day. 
Fuck Luda's me, Masillion, man. Ludus, he drinks a gallon of vodka every day. He, he, we, we call it the 1516. It's 1399 with tax. It's called, it, it comes to 1516. I wrote a song about it. <laughs> it might be Holy. all that you need, the sweet 1516. Um... He's obsessed. He's obsessed with his vodka, with his Georgian, Georgian, specifically Georgie vodka okay. in Poland Spring bottles. He, d- he drinks nothing else. He will drink nothing else. That's not a bad idea. Yeah. What, what, <laughs> what, <laughs> what, what's the, what's the drive that keep, either, both of you guys, man, Joe, my, what's the drive to keep you from just not jumping in front of a garbage truck and say, fuck it, this is just, why, uh, not, yeah, why live? What's the future? Because you live because you think there's, there's always a future. Mm-hmm. Do you see a future? And, do yeah. you see, and what's your future like? What do you want out of the, the, the future? I make music. Out of all of this, this whole story, the end, not the end of the story, the middle of the story, before I came to New York, um, I started writing music. I started making music. Um, so for me, that's what it's about for me right now. I'm living by music. I imagine Joe's probably living for his kids more than anything else. Yeah, that's what I was getting ready to say. Yeah. Um, they just I, fucking Keith, can you... Can you go out and find some fucking <laughs> crazy bums? Like, can you? Yeah, you should bring them out with you. You bring these guys and they fucking human beings. Well, you know, <laughs> Where's one with a fucking arrow through his head well, from we fucking yeah, we 62? A little bit. Last week, those guys. Th- we want them foaming at the yeah. mouth. Yeah, like a fucking. So we don't have this? any emotions well, for well, them. Look at man Jesus last week. Christ. Look at Joe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those well, guys last week. The price. Get closer to the mic, Joe. I don't. I don't mean to. I don't mean <laughs> it's to. Anyone, but I don't want to sound like you're not a take. Saving any money and you lose your job when companies emerge, it can happen. To oh some damn! And you guys had nobody around. You. I don't mean to sound like I'm uh-huh. taking something for granted, but you guys had nobody around because I've thought about this. You know, I work in entertainment. I'm like homelessness is not that far away if I don't play my cards right. <laughs> Especially, but I, but I always say. I always say, well, God damn, somebody in my family will let me live with them. Like, you had nobody around you. Like, you're, you said you had a wife. She wasn't like, dude, come sleep on the couch, man, so the next off. Metallica she video comes along. Me. Huh? She took off on me. She split. She split. Well, she took off with a woman. You're kidding, man. You're <laughs> oh, kidding. Really? Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> I heard that. What did you say? I heard that. She took off with a woman named Sinead. Your, your wife left you for yes. a woman? Yes, sir. And you're not into that? <laughs> you could have had a home yeah, fucking mustard. Right? <laughs> if you just say, hey, baby, do your thing, you should have told me. Nah, honestly. <laughs> mustard and his bitches, nigga. There's the sitcom. <laughs> supportive of me. You know, I have clothes there. She stays in um in Orange, New Jersey. Why don't you go live with her, man? I go there, take a shower, eat, whatever. Then after um, football games over the weekend, you know, I was actually thinking about going there today because... Uh, because of the coldness last night or whatever, you know. And, um, you know, she she's very supportive of me, you know. But um, I don't know. I'm not really helping out with the rent. Even though she paying, you know, whether, you know, the kids say, well, whether you hear or not, she still got to pay the bills. So, you know. What's the evil part, Joe? What's the what's, what's the evil? What's the what's the shit? Because because we getting, you know, we getting the, uh, the, the part of where you go, oh, man. But what's the shit you go, we go, man, you motherfucker, Joe. Like, what'd you do? Like, what was the bottom, to anybody, like, what was the bottom of where motherfuckers would go, Joe, I think you need to, like, not ever show up. You know, no, I can. Um, when you knock him, when I can even woman out, my sister house, my aunt come over. I mean, I can go to my family, right? The, you know, my mom's passed away, my pops, you know, he's still living, you know, but um, I don't be around them when I'm out in the street or whatever, and you know, so what did, I you, stay what away. did you what did you do? Did you ever like hit your wife? You ever hit your kid, like in a, in a fit of being drunk or whatever. And same mm-hmm. thing to you, Mustard. Like, you ever do some shit like you just like, no, oh, she, man, she, I got to keep away from people. She, she used to beat me up. <laughs> really? <laughs> that was the straw that broke yeah. her camel's back. Was We when, were fighting for like three days. Back. Three <laughs> days straight, okay? Somebody called the cops. The cops show up. In California, they have a law. If there's a domestic dispute, oh. complaint or whatever, they have to arrest somebody. Because some, at some point, sometime a long time ago, they used to just let people walk away and then come back. And some guy came back and killed his I wife. So now it's like, no, they got to arrest somebody. And it was you or her? Usually it's the man. Right. But I had blood all over my face. So they arrested her. They arrested oh. her. She did not like that. That cunt. <laughs> she, nah, I wasn't. Yeah. Mustard had a future. Yeah, Mustard She's did. See what person. happens loving Must- these bitches. Good she, for Tiger. Mustard. She's a very passionate person. All the people I've ever loved have been very passionate people. Mustard, you seem very aware. Are you going to uh, get your shit back together? I, I, I've got to get my shit together. Do you want to? Could have been. Could have been. Should have been. Or maybe he's not. 
No, that's <laughs> a, uh, I'll do that. No, 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 no. That's a song I wrote. That's a song okay, I wrote. Right. Got to get my shit together. Right. I did it last time. Don't do that, Opie. Come on, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do yeah, that. that was. Don't do that. <laughs> that, I like that song. That was better than any song on Joe's CD. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Joe, you play, uh, not Joe, play guitar. Sorry. Muscle, you play guitar? I play guitar. I, I have a, Wait, I, do we have a guitar in this joint? Yes. Yeah. Somebody have a guitar? Oh, uh, I want to hear him fucking. Yeah, we got somebody looking for one. All right, yeah, Yay. we got a CD. Now, I've written so, some really good songs. Right, I have a CD, but I'm not sure if it works. Muscle, do you have a Facebook, too? <laughs> yes, I have a Facebook and a MySpace. A homeless guy with a Facebook? And MySpace? I, I, I know homeless people with Blackberries. He's got a fucking CD, Dude, man. he just Dude, said. Man. I, know, I know homeless people with Blackberries, man. Only in America. Only in America. Can I ask uh, Joe something? <laughs> I, 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 both you guys, I guess, but mostly Joe. Is it easier to be homeless? <laughs> easier to be on the streets? Because we hear that from time to time. But there's a lot of pressure when you, you, you when you clean your shit up and you gotta like, have responsibilities be. and stuff. Uh, Do you nah, want to be homeless? It's, 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 it's stressful. Yeah. Which way? Being homeless? Yeah. yeah. Well, today it has to be stressful. I'm, I, I I walk from the garage to to here, yeah. cold. and I'm like, Lordy, Lord, like you know, woo. I know. I got a bun. I should get a scarf. Real quick. Like, doing that so too. there's somebody that that he lives out there, right? But like, I would think not being on the grid at least mm -hmm. gives you an advantage. Where I mean, in the summertime, if you're chilling and this and that, and you find, but you know what? They can't. It can't be. Living on the street cannot I mean, be. People always say that they'd be like, "Yeah, it's getting ready to get cold or whatever." But like, really living uh, on the street, whether it's hot or cold, really is right. not good for. A uh, it must, uh, must. How do you update your site? Uh, well, Anthony, <laughs> speaking of that, I was, I was wrong. I was wrong. Dickie Punchcock writes, "It's actually filthy Facebook." Oh Jesus! Oh, wow. <laughs> but, the library. I go to the library. Oh, the library. Yeah, library. And the Apple Store is good for certain things, but I like the library. I go to the library. You're punching up shit at right. the Apple Store. Joe, Where's the good in, that, indoor yeah. place to sleep? Self, never go to Joe, Apple I still, store again. I still don't understand, <laughs> though, man. You got, you got your sister, who's got clothes and shit for you. To have. Why don't you just go stay with her and get a job at a fucking Seven Eleven and get on your feet? And I don't understand why you can snap. They, she, the, thanks. She don't feel I'm, safe. I'm really asking. She don't feel safe. He's saying she, she, he said he don't want to stay there. He said that. Because he knows. Wait, let's ask him. Joe, why don't you want to stay with your wife? No, his sister. sister. I mean his sister. I'm I mean, sorry. I sister, sister. You no, know, I've stayed there at times, but I, you know, I just always leave. She, she, uh, I'll go out to work with her in the morning, you know, she works at a college, and then, you know, from there, I just get on the train at a bus. And, and she has expectations. That's another thing. She, she's trying to better... Better mm -hmm. him. When she go there, she's on his ass like, Joe, right, the right. fuck you doing? And Not he's like, man, I just want to take a shower and... Well, he's saying he's, and he's think about heroin. <laughs> he's saying she doesn't do that. So what? that's what I'm, I'm respectfully asking you. What? What's stopping you from just living there with her and saying, you know, I'm ready. I'm going to get my shit together. I'm gonna it's be 20 off degrees. Is it like... Is it like, are you like a guy like in Vietnam? Are you like Christopher Walken in Deer Hunter where you're like, I ain't coming back? <laughs> I'm fucking staying here. Is it like at that point where you're just <laughs> lost in the jungle, or you know? No. Nice walking. Well, what's 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 preventing you from just? Yeah, there's a there's a restless uh, restlessness there, Joe. Like you, it looks like you don't feel comfortable just being being uh, in the house there, yeah. and are constantly leaving. Maybe so. I mean, you know, maybe because I'm not help providing or whatever. I feel, you know. Like that because I'm mm. not really giving anything, you know, at the time, which she don't, you know. She don't, uh, she very supportive. Like, is this couch getting uncomfortable? You need some bottles or some shit on it? To, to, or you gonna get up and walk away? <laughs> it's amazing the relationship you develop with the cardboard. <laughs> Fucking A, man. I'm trying to prepare myself for homelessness, nigga. I'm sleeping on the floor right, later. Get, <laughs> collect, collect cardboard. Let's get back to mustard. <laughs> so mustard. Mustard, where do you sleep every night? Uh, you know, various places. We find our places. Uh, Some of sleep on subway, certain doorways, as he was saying. Um, in the summertime, you know, in July, it's, it's fine. Easy, you can right? kind of crash anywhere you want it. Any right. great indoor there's a couple during of, the day places where they, they don't fuck with you? You can just, if you find a little spot. in the library. Spot. I love the library. The library don't fuck with you. I go to the libraries go. all the time. Librarians are assholes, but they don't fuck with you. Um, no, I think librarians fuck with, like, crazy homeless guys like you were talking about if they start, you know. Going nuts. Hey, I'm, I'm one of those, you know, right yeah, now. Yeah, he's a fucking crazy homeless I'm guy. I'm lucid right now. I'm lucid right now, but I've, I, I've been psych ward. I've, been, I've had my crazy oh, moments. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you okay. just seen Keith because he, 
Wait a minute. You just seen Keith when 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 Mustard got up oh, yeah, to come over here. He's watching Danny like a. And, 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 he's and Keith Mustard is like, like you hawk, don't let Mustard yeah. fool you, motherfucker. Mustard, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mustard, Keith got nervous there, didn't he? Mustard, let's get into the crazy thing. What's the craziest thing you did out there on the street? Oh, I bite people. Oh, that's good. God oh, okay. damn. <laughs> I walk. Around, I walk around. And here talk we to go. Myself. I walk around <laughs> talking to myself all the time. Do you have voices? Did you listen no, to that? No, I mean, I mean, I have conversations with myself and other people who are there. <laughs> right. But I like hear, I don't have auditory hallucinations, no. Okay. No. Um, so why are you talking to yourself? I got no one else to talk to. Uh, makes <laughs> sense. Fair right. enough, nigga. He's got an answer I for everything. Fair enough. He's got an answer for everything. I got shit to yeah. say, yeah. motherfucker. I got shit to say. Fair. Yeah. I mean, the cop, everyone. I mean, le less than 14 hours ago, he wasn't a pair of handcuffs. I mean, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Why? What'd you do? I don't know. I don't even See, remember. Yeah, he was pretty. He was pretty tanked last night. Yeah. When, when, uh, when we finally ran into him. Why, why are I the was sitting on a stoop waiting for my, for my friend that Miguel. Was, I think you might have been a little picture. belligerent. A little belligerent. So he, he ended up in a pair of handcuffs, which kind of made my job a little easier. But, <laughs> you know, that, and you don't mind, Mustard, you don't mind Keith even though he's arresting you? Nah, he's... It's such a weird fucking relationship. <laughs> it is. It really got. is. You have no with, idea. With the, the relationship cop. I've developed with the sixth precinct, <laughs> right. it, it freaks me out. <laughs> why? It freaks me out. That why? was such... <laughs> The, you know, the sixth pre precinct, my, my perimeter is 14th Street, uh, Broadway, Houston, Sixth Avenue. That's Got, pretty much. I gotcha. stay within those. Those. Gotcha. You know, yeah. this is this is really uptown for me right now. You ever think um, about committing a crime? Like a, a, you gonna try to rob a bank, and if you succeed, you got some money. If you don't, you get 20 years in in, fucking indoors. In, in warmth. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever been in prison? Yeah. In, what's in warmth? What you mean in warmth? He's talking about prison. Oh no, yeah. not yeah. Like you get, you just do something. You just inside oh, for so the rest of your fucking life. Yeah. Nah, that's stupid. Yeah. Freedom. I want freedom. Right, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, These fuckers you can want take freedom. Away home, but you can want take away freedom. 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 For the word they freedom. Want, they, that, that's a that's a yeah, bet. That's a great yeah. argument. I'm sorry. I'm too hey, freedom. Prison must be fucking down. horrendous. <laughs> if homeless guys are like, no fucking way. <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. I mean, yeah. it's gotta really suck, man. Either one of you guys. <laughs> either one of you guys go. No, no. All right, Patrice. Patrice. No. Either one of you guys go underground ever. You mean like Subway? Well, no, I mean, we hear about the mole people, which fascinates the hell out of us. Oh, people that live tunnels? underground. Yeah, the tunnel oh, people and no, all I've that. I've never been down there. I don't know. No? Is that bullshit or is that real? No, I think that's real. No, it's, it's, it, I've seen people walk that way, but I, I can't really, like, verify yeah. for myself. That right, I've right. Seen it, I'm yeah. pretty sure it's a real thing, though. And I've, I saw a documentary once. It's, yeah. There was thousands, a, yeah. They say there's thousands of people living below the streets yeah. of New York right yeah. now, as we In speak. In old tunnels like that. that aren't being used anymore, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, Mustard's got a guitar, a guitar oh, yeah. in front of him. You want to yeah, play yeah, something for us? Song. Okay. Blast okay. us out some tunes. <laughs> this is a song I wrote about Salvador Dali and biting the people. 1516? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Joe, you know his song, 1516? <laughs> no, I just heard him say it. Yeah, it sounds like a song we want to hear, right? Might be all that I need. That's not what I'm going to play, though. All right. Well, that's how it should be. I 
harvest A trouble, trouble on the double Baby, buys and cuts and bubbles All over me It's not like it's the first time I saw her Next time, won't you remember to forget You forget I'm about the last time we met First time I saw her Next time won't you Remember to forget To forget I'm about the last time We Met Holy oh, shit right. Jesus Christ. Christ You just blew oh, Anthony away yeah. man Anthony was right. looking at me like What the that fuck fucking good, Remember man. to forget The guy's got a oh, good man. Fucking powerful voice. Dude, I would and fucking listen to that shit all day long. It's a good song. Yeah. That's real good what stuff. Why am we I living on the streets, here. motherfucker? We're in a wacky world here. <laughs> a terrible world, man. Yeah. Yeah. Wacky, yeah. wacky, wacky yeah. makes it sound world. wonderful. It's a terrible world, man. That's, That's a, a horrible place. Fucking mustard mayor. That's a mustard. fucking Jesus voice right there. <laughs> <laughs> like, like fucking damn. fall down drunk what or whatever, fuck? right? What the fuck? There's yeah. money. There's cocksuckers making money, right? Yeah. With no talent. E exactly. Yeah. And they don't drink. Exactly, right? Yeah. Talentless, sober motherfuckers. He can fall down, but he... What he the fuck? I might be a fall risk. <laughs> yeah, but he can but everybody in the but fucking I, I 60s kick out the jams, was, was a had a habit. This All is right. this shocking, well, man. People are <laughs> losing their minds on the phones. They're like, I will pay $25 for this song if it goes to this guy. Okay. Well, I mean, if you join us for the homeless shopping spree next Thursday, you're going to meet Mustard. I got 45 cents in my pocket. I'll take the $25. Yeah, you should bring some fucking CDs with you. I don't got them. There's a girl, a girl, an NYU student named Tara. Right. Or Tara. Guitara. Like Tara. Yeah. Guitara. Uh, she, she does a radio show on the NYU station. Okay. She has my music. Jesus. She what? has it. Mustard, what the F? She's probably Mustard, selling it. Mustard, Make man. sure she's not selling your fucking music, Mustard. That is the You're shit. You're making a million dollars off of Crazy Mustard's fucking crazy great mustard. fucking <laughs> song. Did you, ever, did you ever do like a fucking music thing with the case opened up and people tossed some cash in oh, yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I make more money sitting on the street crying. Are you shitting me? No. Than just some fucking talent showing yeah. some sheer uh, talent. I made my money just sitting on a piece of cardboard crying to myself. Crying to yourself. Do you do, you do the fake cry or is it real? No, it's real. No, because some of the guys, I mean, you got to be honest. They, no, it's they have I got a lot of emotion in me. But and you just kind of just let the, let, the, you let your emotions yeah. get the better of you. But that is a horrible thing, passing by a homeless guy who's crying. If you don't give money, you're a fucking you're piece, really of piece of shit. By the way, you are a piece of shit. By the way, DeRosa just canceled his uh, album release yeah. party. <laughs> <laughs> That's why Joe is shutting up. He was eating a banana and just threw it down real hard. I don't know if you're telling me. I piece of shit. <laughs> Keith, well, what do you got? When we, uh, when you talk about even like guys I faking home. it, faking it, like, God, shit like it. that. We we had a guy who used to sit downtown, and uh, every day he collected a hundred and seventy five dollars. He sat on the same corner every day. Holy! Lived shit. in Brooklyn. Right. Had a smoke. house. Had two kids in college. That's what he did. And, and that the was same, his job. Just, the same morons. And it was fake, right? It was fake. Yeah. Every day, the same they morons would come. And he said, I take $175 six cash. days a week. Where did he cash. sit? <laughs> where, where did he sit? Pretty, pretty close to where you guys hang out downtown. And God. Yeah, I don't so you figure he, was, he was making uh, wow. $1,000 or maybe a little more in cash a week. And he had two kids in college. That's how he put them through. And he said, the same people come give me money every day. Now, Mustard, do you do any covers? Yeah. What do you do? Maybe we... Hold on. What, what do you want to do? You'll recognize this. Okay. Mustard. It's a great anthem of my youth. Oh, I think we know this no one. Oh, shit. <laughs> I want to hear this interpretation. When you hear the fall Could look you in the eye Can it make me cry? You're just like an angel in this beautiful world. You're so fucking special. I 
wish I was special <clears throat> But I'm a creep I'm a It's okay if it hurts Don't wanna have control I want a perfect body I, I, I want me one of those Brand new perfect songs I said I want you to know that When I'm not around yeah. So fucking special I wish I was special But I'm a creep I'm a little What the hell am I doing here When I don't belong here I, 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 I I don't belong here I don't belong here What the fuck am I doing here When I don't belong here I, I, I. Whatever makes you happy Whatever you want So fucking special. Oh, I wish I was special. Jesus, Monster, Jesus what the Christ. fuck? Wow. We, we gotta clean your God shit up, damn. man. Now I'm damn depressed. <laughs> yeah, you know that is the best that interpretation choked. of that song I've heard besides Radiohead. You would, you would what win. The you would fuck. You would absolutely win on Idle American. Yeah, but then, then you might contractually obligated to be an asshole for ten years or something, dude. Do I really want to do that. That choked me up a little bit, dude. Yeah. What the Holy fuck? You should be choked, playing music. Me up too. It chokes yeah. me up too. You should be playing every fucking night. What Amazing. are we gonna do here, mustard? I don't. When I first came to New York, I did. I played some gigs. I played some places. I played some places. Places. Can you stay away from the vodka a little bit to get some shit done? What about that? You know, I lost all this shit. I was sober. I was yeah, sober. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, we're all here. Take okay. my money. Yeah. <laughs> here, here, throw that thing. Somebody spot me. I don't have any cash on me. Oh, Jesus, Joe. What the fuck? I'm sorry. Must have just collected a nice little fucking bundle. Joe, we'll give you money too. Trust me. Just now, we're splitting. We're hitting. Okay. No, wait, wait. But must have said something in there. I thought that it went bad because of the vodka. He goes, no, I lost this shit before I started drinking. You probably just got bored. All this shit happened really more because of depression than anything else. I wasn't until I came to New York that I started the drinking, really. I mean, I had my first drink when I was 10 years old. Don't get me wrong. I've been drinking all my life. Yeah. But when all this shit went down, no, I was I was pretty much sober. Um, you, know, you know, every once in a while, but no, Dude, it's not till so I it's not till I it's song. not till I hit the streets that I start drinking every day yeah. and drinking I the way that I do. It, I like would... I drink a liter of vodka every day. Yeah. A liter of yeah. vodka. A liter of day. vodka every day. <clears throat> I see. And I have it. to just to just to be it, reasonable. It's just about to be it's almost coming in. It it, it and it's hard. And Anthony's hard. Uh, dude, Anthony got a cry guy, in him. He got a cry that in him. Guy is no, Anthony like, was blown away. <laughs> he's the fucking. There's, a, there's some tears monster. on the fucking there's way, too man. Much somehow talent there. there. That talent is ridiculous. It's no bullshit, right? Yeah, it's yeah. just it's no that's bullshit. The fucking real I, deal. I'm, sound, I mean, a very creative guy, obviously. This mustard. Jesus. Wow. Out of all, all out of all this depression and bullshit, that's what came out of it. I started writing music. I didn't used to do this. Yeah, but your interpretation of that song, fuck, it's good. Rock. And he yeah, had confidence because yeah. I'm like, wait, we'll pick the fucking song. He goes, don't worry about it. I got yeah, it. Yeah. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. Yeah, no shut doubt. Up, DJ. Oh, he shut I my ass this. up. <laughs> <laughs> he shut my ass up. Doom, 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 doom. I swear to God, if you had shit on iTunes, dude, oh, yeah. I would download I'm on a whole YouTube. fucking CD. People keep telling shit. me they see me on YouTube, but I, I haven't seen it. Really? Yeah, I'm on YouTube somewhere. Is uh, your name Has your name been mustard the, for a long time? Well, my name is Daniel Mustard, Daniel Jonathan Mustard, DJ Mustard, DJ Mustard. 
mustard. How retarded is that? <laughs> yeah, I know, I know, right? Yeah. I'm going to kick my mother for that one. Um, and uh, no, twice? I go by the moniker <laughs> Saint Hollywood. Saint is night. No, Saint Hollywood is I really actually from Hollywood, California. I was born in Hollywood, California. Right. Do we have one more time to hear him say? Can I have a request? I, I, do you I, do? Do you do any Nirvana? No. No. Right. Shit. What about, I like that. Uh, I like I'd, rather Otis. I'd rather sing you Otis than Kurt, to be honest. Otis Redding? Yeah. Otis Redding. Oh, you know she's weary. Young girls that do get weary. Wearing that same old shaggy dress. But why she get weary? Come on. Try a little tenderness. <laughs> you know what? I yeah. bet you the liquor. I bet you ten years ago you stunk. <laughs> that liquor probably did something, that voice it did something to his voice. voice. Yep, and the yeah. motherfucker's oh, yeah. brilliant. Yeah, yeah. I used to, yeah. When he was when he was whiskey drinking. vodka and lots of cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to him play now, man. I, yeah. know, I, know. I don't know what to do. We have we have fucking like bands, established bands, established musicians. They come in, they play a song, and they're like, "Ah, right, let's get them the fuck out of here." Like, I just want to hear you fucking play shit. Can we play another song? That's fucking Can we play another song? I got no I problem. I don't give with a shit. Yeah, People seem to be loving it out there. It's this is Mustard, one of our homeless great. guys. Let me set it up. Mustard will be on the homeless shopping spree next Thursday. Yeah. Make sure you check we out run at the right mall. to the Apple Store or whatever to fucking get him shit to sing. Yeah, no shit. Tentatively as I've been tied, I'd say if I had dug it, so I guess I could have known better. By the time I figure out the way, I figure out the rest. I want to study forever And if you want it to get it right You want it to risk You got to stick to the ladder But as I'm looking in this face tonight You said I went to luck I see you start to untether And I said What I've been Caught I've been Shut up been the only one you want but I can't get my shit to get, but I can't get my shit to cut up and shut up and what I've been the only one you want. But I can't get my shit, but I can't get my shit together. Yeah, yeah. But I can't get my shit together. But I can't get my shit to. Oh, I fucked it up. <laughs> Sensitively as I've been bound, I bet if I was to bet, I bet I could have known better. But by the time you turn around, it's set and everything you get just got to to bother ladder. And if you want it to get it right, if you want it to rest, you got to stick to the, you got to stick to the. And as I'm looking at that fast tonight, instead of where the light, I see you start to untether. I said, what I've been, caught I've been, should I've been the only one you want. But I can't get it to, but I can't get my shit together. Should I've been, caught I've been, what I've been the only one you want. But I can't get it now, but I can't get my shit to now, but I can't get my... But I can't get my shit together. But I can't get my. But I can't get my shit together. But I can't get my. But I can't get my shit together. But I can't get my. But I can't get my shit done. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ha, 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 yeah. What I been? Caught I been? Shut up and. Holy fucking shit. Jesus Christ. I got to tell you this, man. Simon Cowell uh, fucking discovered Susan Boyle. Well, we discovered mustard. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's not some traffic studio we could just sit him in all day and give yeah, him his right. own channel what or something? Fuck? I mean, he's what? Only, he, I mean, he's only got any water. tracks from an album. <laughs> He, he just did three tracks. Yeah. And that's, what, seven more? Oh, I got right more. Dude, I got more. <laughs> I got more. <laughs> okay. God damn. I got more. I, Thank mustard. you very much. Mustard, this, I will this, say, this I will say this right is, now. Is fucked. 
I will say this right now. I will fund a CD, no problem. I will fucking get a CD made. I have musicians. I have a, I even have an engineer. All I need is We money. got True Boogie. We got a really good engineer, for real. Oh, okay, you, okay, fine, let's do it. I mean, if I'm you have no go. one else, I will fucking fund... I will put money forward so this fucking guy gets I'm a CD out there. I'm only because I don't... You and you know what, Mustard? You can, Mustard, I don't want to... That was great. He got up and, like, sat down. I know. Like, Mustard, <laughs> I don't even want a cent from the CD, but I will... Fun, just, I, just... I'll, I'll do the session. He's all drunk and bites you. <laughs> <laughs> and his friends who play spoons. He's going to bring up. We his understand. fucking musicians play spoons and they just, <laughs> right, right. They just talk inside of cups. Mustard, we jug. need fucking a <laughs> jug. Beer Somebody play, play a jug. Right. Play right. a jug. <laughs> it's a fucking jug band, right? right. <laughs> 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 ham on ham on, have you heard? <laughs> he, he holds the fun and he gets in the studio. He must have gone, shut the fuck up, Oh, I got this. <laughs> ham on ham on, have you heard? You know, you know what? I'll, 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 I'm gonna buy you a mockingbird. I'll take that chance. I'll take that chance. Uh, Although it didn't work out well when we got Grey Wolf in the studio. Let's not yeah, forget. True. Let's not forget the this shelter. Is, the this shelter is me, man. This that fucking this shelter me. <laughs> that fucking shelter me needed one more verse, and we had a massive yeah. hit on our <laughs> on our hands. People are fucked right. up. And we tried for years to get that second verse, and it never happened. Motherfucker. He gets in the studio, <laughs> and Obi goes, "This is it, man." Ah, and he just it. screams. It's just. Hitting everybody with the guitar. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I'm mustard, motherfucker. Hey, I'll be beat me, me, me with guitars. I've done that a couple times. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> That's happened. You yeah. want to play the songs you were playing? These are the fucking These songs. Are. <laughs> You're not the boss of me. <laughs> fucking throws vodka on you and lights you on fire. I'll fucking take that <laughs> chance. The clock is ticking. <laughs> fucking money ticking off. And Joe's sitting there going, You don't know the real fucking mustard. You have no fucking I idea. Do. No fucking mustard. idea. Yeah. Joe's like, whatever, Holy wait till you shit. see what yeah. happens. <laughs> Joe's going, stupid white boy. <laughs> white boy, you think the... <laughs> I'm a cracker, cracker ass cracker. <laughs> I'm a t-shirt, cracker ass cracker. Oh, shit, Obi's so cracker. fucking touched. I, Dude, I, I can't wait till he goes in and Mustard flips out. <laughs> and he plays with studio time. Oh. And he tries to choke him with a guitar string. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's an interesting <laughs> idea. I've never tried that. <laughs> Fucking fold into the drum kit. Yeah. If this motherfucker's too talented to I'm not gonna... have something happen. Yeah, well, yeah. Mustard's an ass some kind of way. <laughs> Did you try to get shit on CD? What happened over the years? I have a CD. I have a couple of uh, demos. Yeah, but we don't know how to get it. Yeah, well, I have it in my pocket. Yeah, you have a couple in your pocket. I, I remember last well, night. No, I have them. the original in my pocket. You can't have it, but you can try to play it if you want. Well, then the, there's the, no, you're, again, the girl, I'd rather the girl, hear you live, you girl. She has, uh, I'd rather hear you live. You got a nice raw show. Hey, uh, it's in there somewhere. I don't know if you really want to hear it. Anthony all. and I are huge fans of Alice in Chains. You got any Alice Lane. in you? I don't play Lane, but I don't play Alice, but I love Alice. Okay, all right. I'm the I was just asking. In the box. Right. Well, the creep did it. The creep yeah, that was, was a great ridiculous. version of that. No, Lane, Lane, Lane is one of the great losses, I think. Lane Staley, Shannon Hoon, Kurt, obviously, Elliot Smith. You know, these are people I wish I had had a chance to know. You know. Mm -hmm. Now they're gone. Do you them. have a guitar on the street all the time? No. How do you write these songs, man? Well, you know, you get a well in Washington Square Park. Let me. This is Washington Square Park in 1941. Woody Guthrie. You know Woody Guthrie? Yeah. Woody Guthrie came to Washington Square Park in 1941. He slept in that park. He lived in that park. He ate in that park. He shit in that park. He fucked in that park. He bled in that park. So have I. And he brought to the world what was known as American folk music. When Bob Dylan came to New York, he came to New York looking for Woody Guthrie. Where did he find Woody Guthrie? Washington Square Park. Joan Baez, Patti Smith, William S. Burroughs. There's a, there's a mural on a supermarket on LaGuardia and Bleecker that features a bunch of people. Except there's like, uh, uh, there's uh, Edgar Allan Poe and Mark Twain have no business being in the mural. But everybody else in that mural are all people who have lived in, uh, in and around Washington Square Park or the village. You know, right. it was known as Greenwich Village. Um, when I came to New York, the book I was reading was Bob Dylan's Chronicles. And it's all about how, when he first came to New York. And so that's what I did. I came to Washington Square Park. You know, I thought that's where, that's, you know, that's what you do. You know, it's, fu you know, it's fucked up. We, rem it's, now, you remember the, the great late Tippy Tom. Uh, we saw Tippy fucked up first. Then we saw him sober when he was in the hospital. Remember yes, that? Of course. And, and, we, were, person, and right? we were like, yeah, we were like, Holy shit. So here's the problem. <laughs> I know yeah. there's a problem. The I'm problem. not stupid. Now, we are, we are seeing mustard. I'm willing to take that we chance. We are seeing mustard at the top of his game right now. Yeah. Sober, fucking 
for the I'm not part, sober, but well, I'm, yeah, I'm not yeah, fucked up. I'm not, not fucked up. up. Yeah. When he's fucked <laughs> up, I bet you wouldn't even fucking recognize oh, him. Oh, I'm an, I'm an animal. I'm an asshole. <laughs> Keith, I'm such an asshole. Uh, Keith, 14 hours ago, he was a little difficult to deal with. <laughs> 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 a little bit hilarious. Yes. Oh, there's one hour a day. That that would be what's, what's, the, what's the percentage that he has? 12 like cops this, to hold me down one night. 12 cops to hold me down. Oh, that's great. 12 cops. Is this This was like a year ago. This is like a year ago. Is this an aberration right here, or is this this regular? Uh, he, he's pretty good. I mean, I do, so, we had a long conversation last night, and and uh, I, I tried the technique today where he, he gave me he had a twenty dollar bill in his pocket from last night because I did have to kind of convince him. <laughs> to come you know, down. If you make it six hours from now to when to when uh, I need you in the morning, I'll give you the other half a twenty dollar bill. <laughs> Listen, oh, your only chance, <laughs> but, motherfucker, but, is, right, fuck it. is right, to fuck fucking it. do the album right, now. It. I know, that's what I'm starting to think. This is, it's either, it's is D-Boy around? Either do it now, or the whole band, the backup band has to be a SWAT team. Just in case shit goes off, you gotta have a riot squad as the band. <laughs> do this album right fucking now! Where, where's the other half of 20? Let me tape it together for you. So All right. Ma now, Mustard, what are the odds you're gonna be in the homeless shopping spree next Thursday? Oh, I think I'm gonna go, I think I'm gonna bring some people with me too, right? Yeah, yeah, he's gonna. Okay. You know, you know, like, like what we were talking about. How last week I had a little difficulty, and uh, and uh, Liquor Man and and the other fellows with him were, were kind of yeah. standby sort of guys because, <clears throat> like the first time we did it back at NEW, when we got to when we got to the radio station and they, they you know they were scared because <laughs> they thought it was the setup. She has so the setup. <laughs> they, you know, guys like Joe and guys like Mustard. They're, they're like ambassadors now because they're going to go out and and they were there here today and they're gonna they got ninety dollars yeah, yeah. in their pocket they're buying the booze today let's be honest they're gonna go <laughs> buy the booze the today booze. I'm buying the fifteen sixteen you know, so, so when, when, when he's sitting there with the fifteen sixteen and they're all drinking and he's talk, talking about how he went on the radio people are now going to look for me the you know the rest of the week yeah, until it's uh, a good it's a good fucking thing it's like you know it really is man hang out it's, it's no a setup. fun day everybody goes out gets some fucking coats whatever you need for the winter i mean i wouldn't be i'm not making any promises but i swear to god i wouldn't be surprised if someone buys you a fucking guitar Right. That's what I, yeah. Our listeners are fucking, you know, pretty. Yeah. You know, That's you know, what I need. I mean, you know what's hilarious? This one. I like this one. What's hilarious is I've never <laughs> seen two more lax homeless guys. You're trying to convince a homeless guy to go on a fucking shopping spree right now. <laughs> no, it's like, yeah, you you know, get to go get the free shit? Hey, I might go down. I don't yeah, know. Sure, you know, whatever. Well, you know, honestly, <laughs> can I, wait, can I just bond to that? Honestly, it's an interesting thing. Um, you get what you need. You know, whether you, you want to send me to the mall or not. Um, I sit there on the sidewalk, and, and it's it's amazing to me. Yesterday, I needed gloves, so I walked into McDonald's, and somebody left a pair of gloves there. You know, you really you find what you need. You cannot go hungry. People are always bringing you food. Um, there's soup kitchens all over the city. You know? Yeah, that's what I wanted to ask you, man. Do you do you ever have to eat out of the trash cans, or is that have, like old school? I have. Homeless? No, I have. Um, mostly what I do is during lunchtime, I'll sit in the park, and I'll watch people eat. And then when they're done, I'll be like, are you going to finish that? Or I'll wait till they throw yeah, it away and just, you know. You're hoping um, you get it before it hits the garbage. Yeah, right? but these days now I just sit in front of McDonald's. Again, I just sit in front of McDonald's. <coughs> I, I get like somebody ba bought me a whole Angus, you know, the People Angus the restaurant style yeah. Yeah. burger they have. The whole kaboot, you know, the oh, fries nice. and coke. And the whole they just think everybody's gonna buy fifteen, sixteen with the money that they give. Right. So they want to feed you. Fucking they want to feed you because they don't yeah. want to give you money because they think you're gonna spend it on and, booze or heroin. Or, and and know, to back some, up Anthony from earlier, uh, when you see mustard, don't be confused. It's not Eastside Dave. It's it's mustard. I, I know. Yeah, yeah somebody was saying this. Because Eastside Dave he's, wants to do the homeless shopping spree, but we already got one now, Dave. He, this guy yeah, looks yeah, like yeah. you with a uh, long beard. Yeah. Looks like a. He's a little bit, yeah. I, mean, I want to finish my story about Washington Square Park. Sure. Yeah, go, man. My first night in Washington man, Square Park, I met a man named Looters Massillion. I love that I get to say his name on the radio. Looters Massillion is he's an old crazy. And now he's a crazy wingbat. He's the kind of guy you want. He 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 he's obsessed with something called psychokinetics. He believes that his entire life, everything he does is controlled by doctors and uh, mind waves, sound waves. They're controlling <clears> him, and everything he does is is somebody else's responsibility. Um... He's an incredible guitar player, though. But he thinks he wrote Sympathy for the Devil. Really? You know? And he gave it to Mick Jagger. He thinks he wrote You know the dude he from The did. Soloist. Uh -huh. He probably did. <laughs> probably did. <laughs> can I say, can Tippy I say Tom this? tells a story about a very famous musician that he swears is true and we believe Tippy Tom? What's the but, story? Uh, 
I mean, can, I some, can, can I suggest an idea for the I'm homeless shop? I'm just saying that I wouldn't be surprised if, that, if the, the story he just told is some true. more no. incentive right. for him to stay uh, sober. Mm. Is that he, that he gives a that he gives one of those circle concerts right in the middle of this mall that oh yeah it is. we get oh, believe me, and he fucking, fucking you get him an amp. And a fucking guitar, and he does a few songs yeah, in the yeah. middle. He's give a listen, concert. Listen yeah, maybe a Christmas fucking... song. Or and the two. other, and the I other homeless guys. He <laughs> ready? He <laughs> comes early. This. He does a fucking concert, and that's the fucking money. Like, and the other homeless guys go around with hats, collect all the money that fucking uh, mustard's getting from his his music, and they spend the money with that shit. Yeah. That they really? make the money with Why the with the work. Because mustard is the work, know, right? motherfucker. Mustard, What's Joe do? Beatbox? He, he, he just, <laughs> Maybe Joe does. Just give me Joe, a beat, Joe. Give you me got a harmonica, motherfucker. Joe, <laughs> Money Joe, let's do this shit. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is wrong with I love Joe? how Patrice just beat me up about the CD thing, and then you came up with that logical scenario. But it keeps also, up. we're going to give him a weapon at the mall. <laughs> he just runs through it. 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 Yeah. Beats a woman in the head at the Fendi store. <laughs> yeah, give him a 40-pound guitar <laughs> with a long handle on the end of it. <laughs> we, should, we should take a break. Uh, uh, Joe and Mustard definitely going to be at the homeless shopping spree next Thursday. Man... This thing just got pumped up to yeah, a, yeah, yeah. another level. Yeah. Next Thursday, we're going to announce the mall on Monday. We're doing afternoon drive, so you can check it out on the radio as these guys shop and do their thing. And Muster will probably play a few songs in the mall. We'll, we'll cool. figure it all out. Yep. You want? Do uh, you have one more cover you could play us to break with, Muster? Um, or are we overdoing it? I actually do a lot of covers, but I can do another original if you'd like. Yeah, your originals are good. Uh, what the fuck? Why not? I right. used to do a bunch of covers, but I forget them, you know? Yeah, I hear you. All right, this is Muster as we go to break. We'll continue with Patrice and uh, Joe DeRosa in a minute or two. And I've been out of my head. I've been crazy for days. I've been lazy in my human ways. And I've been left here for dead. I've been constantly crazy. I've been pestered and pondered and appraised Haven't taught myself to hold Had to force myself to talk And I've been at it for days I've been down here since two But I'm still stuck in the metal with you Hard to say why I sang sad songs Hard to say why you fanged to sang along Hard to say what I'm on about But maybe, baby, I could do without Now it's not up for debate Let's not open the flow Cause baby, you know we've both been here once or twice before But we got here too late Yeah, the hours that through And I'm still stuck in the meadow With you Hard to say why I sang sweet songs Hard to say why you think I sang low Hard to say what I'm on about but maybe, baby, I could do without How to say why I sing a sad songs How to say why you think I sang along How to say what I'm on about But maybe, baby, I could do it. 